Since I live in the north, I have to admit, one of my favorite fish to catch are smallmouth bass. And you know, some of the easiest ways of fishing for them are shallow during the early season and during the fall. Now, when it's early season or there's a period in the fall when they move up shallow and the leaves start to turn, we'll catch them on spinner baits, topwater lures, um, a lot of jerk baits, things that were moving through the water column more horizontally. In shallow water, even if it's crystal clear, you can get them on fairly fast retrieves on a reflex strike. So you want to get these big smallmouth committed to eating that spinner bait or jerk bait or whatever bait you're using at the time. And it's a lot of fun. Now during the summer period, in many of the areas that we fish, they go in deep water. That's when electronics are very important. We'll use our electronics to sight fish for the smallmouth bass. So we're going to look for fish on drop-offs, shoals, humps, and as soon as you mark those hooks, we'll GPS it and we'll drop, say, a drop shot rig right down on top of these smallmouth and not even move it. So what we're looking for is a smaller strike zone. Early season or during that fall period when they're shallow, we use a lot of lures horizontally through the water for a reflex type strike. Deep water, midsummer, we drop a bait right on their head, don't even move it in the deep water, and then all of a sudden you'll see your rod tip load up and you know you got a big smallmouth on, you just lift up and fight that horse to the boat. So there you have it, fishing shallow during the early season, the fall season, and fishing them deep during that midsummer period. Awesome action.